Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for another video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you the September 2021 Whiff Box unboxing. So this was included in my Harvest Collection order, but I filmed that separately so I could do a separate Whiff Box video. And this is that video. I do already know what is in this box. Every month I'm super optimistic that I won't get spoiled and then literally almost every time it happens like the day before my package is supposed to get in that I see someone else post a picture. Some people are good about posting like spoiler, do not watch or do not look if you don't want to see what's in the whiff box and then they'll do like a separate photo that has what's actually in the whiff box. Not this month. I got spoiled almost, I think it was about a day or two ago on Instagram, but it's fine. I'm really excited for this box. I think it's a really good value for money. So if you have been wanting to try a whiff box and fall scents are your thing, this one is going to be the one to pick up. So let's jump right in. I'm always really excited about the whiff boxes. First things first, we have a Harvest Collection brochure. And what's really awesome about this is basically everything is available right now or will be available at some point in the next few months. Um, last year, you know, if you got the September whiff box, you got a Harvest Collection brochure, but the, the bummer about it was half the time the things or a, a few of the products had already sold out by the time you got the Harvest Collection brochure. This time around, that is not the case. So you could actually still shop the Harvest Collection and there's basically everything available. Or if it's not available now, it'll be available at a later date. Pumpkin Cinnamon Swirl Scent Circle. I love this scent, so I'm super excited to have one of those. I think I actually sent out the one that I had picked up a while ago in like a happy mail to my Harvest Collection customers, the ones that purchased from me on the Harvest Collection. So um, I'm excited to kind of replenish my stock for that one. There is a pod pack of Pumpkin Roll. So Pumpkin Roll, I did try this scent last year and it didn't really jump out at me like it wasn't amazing I didn't need more of it but I have been wanting to try it again this year it's a spiced pumpkin cake with a little bit of like a creamy filling kind of scent I just personally prefer pumpkin cinnamon swirl to this one but they don't have pumpkin cinnamon swirl in pods so I think I will definitely get some good use out of that one Bright Cider Life and Hand Soap. Really excited for this. I've mentioned this before, but Bright Cider Life technically, its notes are spiced harvest cider, pumpkin, and red apple. I get like a bakery, almost graham cracker note to it, and I really, really enjoy this scent. So I think in the hand soap, it is going to be perfect. This one's slowly becoming kind of a classic fall scent for a lot of people. I could see that one being around in a lot of fall catalogs in the future. There is a Orchard Apple and Spice fragrance flower in here, which if you watched my Harvest Collection haul already, or if you haven't, spoiler alert, I got one of these. So now I have two of those. What will probably happen is I'll try out one. If I absolutely love it, cool, I have a backup. If not, I'll gift this to somebody, I think, for the holidays. I mean, the holidays are coming up here very quickly. I feel like the last four-ish, I guess, yeah, four-ish months of the year always go by like super, super quickly. I'm sure you guys can relate to that. So the har um, the holidays are right around the corner. So if you get anything um, in, you know, the Harvest Collection or the Holiday Collection, which is coming on the 1st of October, then you can also start stocking up for some gifts for people. Long story short, if I love that scent in the fragrance flower, I'll probably keep it. If I don't love it, I'll gift it to somebody else that will get some good use out of it. Okay, let's talk about what wax is in here. So it's really interesting because the wax that I purchased from the Harvest Collection did not come in a Mylar pouch and it didn't have an ice pack in there. This stuff that was in the Whiff box came in a Mylar pouch, but there's no ice pack. So they're probably kind of easing away from that. Um, it is sort of cooled down here where I am. I think it's like in the mid 70s today and that's about the warmest it's been in the past week. But it's still warm enough that I think if wax sat out for long enough, it would melt. So if you have packages coming in and you're kind of on the West Coast, just be aware that you don't want that package to sit out on your front porch all day. Try to have someone pick it up or hopefully it delivers while you're at home. 
Okay, so Scary Good is in here. Dare I say I'm kind of coming around to Scary Good? <laughs> I am, just a little bit. I also am dying to try a mixture. So Robin, I think it's Robin H, I want to say, um, here on YouTube, she has been mixing this with Coffee Tree. Sorry, that was jumbled. She has been mixing this Scary Good with Coffee Tree to get like a pumpkin spice latte. Yes, please. I need that. I don't know if I have any bars left of Coffee Tree. I think I have one. If I do, that is definitely going to happen here in the next couple weeks. Really excited to um, try out that mix. Like I said, I'm kind of coming around to Scary Good. It's not my favorite by any means, but I will say that if you're a little bit apprehensive about it, it seems that a lot of other people like it. So it's kind of seems like it's just me that doesn't love it. Um, so that's that's a good sign. If you're thinking about picking it up, you'll probably enjoy it. And then we have Fairy Tale Pumpkin. This is the scent of the month for October already. It always blows my mind. All right, so Fairy Tale Pumpkin, it's this like rich blue color, is an epic fantasy of harvest pumpkin, midnight black raspberry, and a whisper of black licorice. So pumpkin, black raspberry, and licorice. So black raspberry is what's in breakfast in bed. So I'm curious to see if they'll be at all similar. If I can get this open every month I struggle. Ooh, yeah, okay, I get black raspberry. Ooh, that is really good, a really rich, black raspberry and pumpkin with maybe just a little bit of a black licorice. I'm not getting a ton of it, which I'm thankful for. Oh, and that blue, black raspberry with the pumpkin just adds this really nice sweetness. That is good. I'm really, really excited about that one and very curious to see how that does when it's melting. So that's fairy tale pumpkin, scent of the month for October. I am getting the warmer again this month. So when the scent and warmer of the month come, which will be in probably a week or two, I will of course share that with you guys. So thanks so much for watching. Like I said, this is a really great value whiff box if you are at all interested in trying out a whiff box, this would be a great month to try. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.